Hello everyone, I am Vinicius Ferreira, and today we have another video with updates about the entire Nulls ecosystem. Over the past month, we've had several important updates, including campaigns with rewards for the community, partnerships, and integrations with other projects. At the start of November, we had the sixth and final round of the Halloween campaign, which brought various rewards in Nulls and USDT for the community. There was also a new proposal for the Nulls ecosystem presented by the rapper Run, one of the co-founders of this project. The idea is to introduce an NFT staking product, allowing people to earn passive income through a staking system and bringing new dynamics to decentralized finance. Additionally, there was a partnership between Nulls and Ape Arcade in the tournament called Clash of Clans. In this meme fighter game, you can choose cryptocurrency-themed characters in battle based on the combinations you create. The faster and more combinations you make, the higher the damage to your opponent. While not exactly an update, Maximus' post on Platform X highlighted four ways to generate passive income with nulls. He mentioned four methods, such as Nulls Pot, where you stake nulls and receive tokens from other projects in return. Traditional staking, where you allocate nulls and receive earnings in nulls. Running nodes on the nulls network, where you can earn rewards from the network if you meet the requirements. And participating in second layer farms via Swapbox, providing liquidity in nulls and other trading pairs. Maximus also presented a much more detailed article there on Binance Square. The next update is about Engage to Earn Season 2, which is coming soon. Basically, it's a campaign where you complete various tasks to earn XP, which can later be used to receive rewards. Most of these campaigns that reward the community are carried out through the Nabox ID platform, which I'll discuss further ahead. There was also a partnership with the company Nexera, which works with RWA organization. This partnership can combine Nexera's project dynamics with Null's modular blockchain, creating an institutional-level RWA infrastructure. This promises exciting developments. Another significant update was the approval of the Bitcoin incentive proposal within the Nulls network, enabling the use of Bitcoin and Ethereum to pay network fees and generating Bitcoin rewards for those staking Nulls. In fact, I've already started earning Bitcoin fractions in my wallet by staking Nulls. This flexibility coupled with cross-chain technologies positions Nulls blockchain as a second layer for both Bitcoin and Ethereum. New listings were also added to POCM, which is a platform that allows you to stake nulls and receive tokens from listed projects in return. New token pools were created, including TNNS Prox, Bullcoin, a memocoin on the Anulls blockchain, MetaPlus token, CPRN, and even the Aura token with 17% APR. For the first time, it was also possible to stake Bitcoin on the nulls POCM platform and receive INULs which can be exchanged for nulls as reward. This highlights Null's positioning as a DeFi solution, and a second layer for Bitcoin facilitating its usage. In terms of integrations, Nerve Network, which handles the cross-chain part of the ecosystem, also brought more compatibility between blockchains. This includes Bitcoin Cash, USDT and USDC integration on the Celo blockchain, and USDT for Kava EBM, all using Nerve Network tools. Additionally, Nerve also received a liquidity grant from the Scroll Foundation, further improving liquidity between blockchains and user experience. For those following the channel, you've probably noticed how this ecosystem increasingly expands into the cross-chain world, bringing new integrations between blockchains and more compatibility with the Nabox wallet. Finally, the decentralized exchange NullSwap is preparing for significant improvements, such as platform restructuring, more efficient contracts, referral systems to attract more users, and integration with other decentralized applications. Before wrapping up, I want to highlight some opportunities within the ecosystem. For example the Alpaca Money minigame on Telegram, which comes with an airdrop already confirmed by Nabox Wallet. Additionally in the activity section, was launched Bubble Pools. Each pool has a set amount of tokens, and by participating daily you can pop bubbles to earn tokens. I've personally earned 46,000 Bullcoin tokens this way. There were other pools like the Aura and Nulls tokens. I'll leave the link to this mini-game in the description for you. Another opportunity is the Nabox ID platform, where you simply complete tasks and earn tokens from various projects for free. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this summary of the main updates. Subscribe to the channel, activate the notification bell and leave a like. Thank you for your audience, and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.